If parents ask me what matters when choosing a school, it's where you think your child is going to be happy. Where they're happy is where they'll thrive, where they thrive is where they will meet their potential. Uh, and that, I think, above all else, is the most important thing. There's so much inspiration. As well as music, I've taken up violin, which I never thought I could do. It's such a small environment, you get to know everyone, um, you know older students. Look adventurously within yourself, you know, find what who you are, in a way. If you want to get the good grades, that's fine, but if you neglect other people and if you don't focus on what actually makes you happy and what makes the people around you happy, in the long run you won't be the person you might have wanted to be. It is nice when you kind of see, you see the sixth former that you look up to and then he's like, oh hey Matt, how are you doing? It's like, you know my name. What? You can just watch people in the gardens having fun, especially in the summer. It's a really nice place to be because everyone goes there. The smile of the school kind of reflected in everyone. In a Quaker meeting, the whole school gathers into a meeting house where we sit in silence for about 20 minutes. You stand up um, in the silence and speak your mind. No one questions what you say. I think at this school, something that encourages just doing something out of your comfort zone and that to yourself can be adventurous. There's loads of exciting things ahead of us and personally I'm just really curious about everything that we can achieve. Our teachers, if we're struggling, they will make appointments with you, they will give you extra lessons. They make you ambitious. We speak to them as adults, not teachers, if that makes sense. For one person, getting a C is the equivalent of another person getting an A star. And to get a C in one subject might have cost someone hours and hours of studying and time and tears, perhaps. It's about personal worth and what your grades mean to you. The teachers know your personality. As a person, I think I'm, I've become very fair. I think that's something that will help me in the future. Just little things that they do make it a home rather than a boarding house. It's not just what our children are doing for the time they're here at school. It's what they are then able to do in all the years after school uh, as a result of the experience they've had here at SIGCAR.